Fuck yeah, Fire's Con. New episode coming out every Thursday at 7 p.m. Come check it out. We're going to do a lot of cool stuff. Like, ah, 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 we're going to do a lot of cool stuff. Ah, ah, ah. What am I doing? You're a monster, Mr. Grinch. Your heart's an empty hole. Your brain is full of spiders. You have garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot pole. Hey, howdy, hey, folks. <laughs> How's it going? Howdy, y'all. <laughs> um, I'm wearing this goofy hat because it's Christmas. Woohoo! And, um, yeah. Welcome to How to Rock a Campfire, everybody. My name is Dustin Cormier. I'm wearing my badass Silver Creek Folk shirt. These guys are friends of mine, and they got some kick-ass music that I highly recommend checking out. They got, like, the band flow, uh, kind of Neil Diamond-ish, Bob Dylan-ish. If you like any of the old stuff that I'm always playing, then you'll love... Silver Creek Folk. I highly recommend. Just look them up on YouTube. They got some cool, groovy videos and stuff on there. On here. YouTube. <laughs> uh, yeah, so today's episode is going to be... Uh, I've been doing a Christmas series lately, and uh, I'm getting these out of the way because I've really been able to, or loving being able to do this. Um, thank you very much to everybody who's been watching my show all this time, or even anybody that just kind of tunes in and says hello. I, I, it means a lot, and uh, I really love the fact that people are still keeping on with me for whatever reason. <laughs> um, and to everybody who does check me out and puts positive comments on my YouTube videos and stuff like that, uh, my heart is right here with you. And it's cool that we can share the sacred space of every single moment, or the particular moments that you watch my videos when you watch my videos. Yeah. <laughs> it's uh, very beautiful that we can share space like that and that you guys are willing to do that with me. And thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. Merry Christmas from How to Rock a Campfire. Okay, now for the real stuff. <clears throat> so yeah, this everyone knows this song, right? You're a mean one, Mr. Grinch. I'm gonna, uh, well, I guess I'll just get right into it and show you guys what I got going on here. I love the lyrics for this song. You know, I don't know if Dr. Seuss wrote these lyrics or if the people that did the cartoon wrote them, but either way, hats off to them because, like, this is <laughs> it's just so funny, you know? If I had to choose between the two of you, I'd pick the seasick crocodile. <laughs> right? Um, <clears throat> so, the song's in the key of. G minor, I would say, um, pretty much, and then the D is the fifth, so G minor is kind of like the key of B flat, right? Um, ooh, yeah, so you're going, uh, I guess I'll go through the chords because they're weird. You're a G minor, C minor, F to the B flat, G minor, A minor, D, and what I like to do for the D chord, usually sometimes I'm well, what I should do is uh, I'll go from the G minor to the A minor and then the D chord up here. And what I like to do is even if you just got to do the bar chord type thing, because uh, you don't want to really carry the high third. Well, maybe you can, but I, what I do for this song when I kind of try to acoustify it is I'll do the D chord just as a bar chord. So, you know, it's just the first, the fifth, and then the high octave again. Just those three notes, kind of like, uh, you know, any sort of thing that you do with, like, a, pow a power chord, uh, you know? That kind of thing, right? Uh, you really are a heel. You're as cut. 
ugly as a cactus or as charming as a eel, Mr. Grinch. <clears throat> so what I do, uh, from what I understand of the song, is I go from the, you know, G minor, C minor, F, B flat, uh, you're as dun 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 charming as a eel, Mr. Grinch. So you go from that B minor and you just take it down one fret. Mr. Grinch, you're a bad banana with a greasy black peel. And I usually, I've, we've, I've done this with my band, and usually what goes on is, um, the, most of the band will just be doing the rhythm section thing, and then we'll have a lead guitarist on top, my, uh, either Josh or Daffy, who's the two guitarists in my band. Um, one of those guys will go, dun dun um, and so those notes are just, you know, B flat, A, G, and then C, G, G. Uh, and so that's like a little melody to add on top. But the chords, if you're just doing an acoustic thing, the campfire with, you know, a fireplace is probably more appropriate for the holiday thing. <laughs> How to rock a fireplace, that's what's up right about now. <laughs> um, ooh, you're a bad banana with a greasy black peel. Uh, so there's two ways to kind of, there's one chord in there that I that you can choose to do and it's kind of technically what they do. It's kind of like an A minor diminished fifth. Uh, but sorry, I'll show you the easy ideal version or the easy idea of the version where you're just going uh bam da 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 go G minor, C minor, and then D, right? And then when you go to that D the same thing as we did with the lifting the D up to the E flat with that bar chord, right? You're a monster, Mr. Grinch. <clears throat> but what I like to do sometimes, if you feel like it, you know, just kind of this uh, thing that you throw in there, because they definitely do this on the bass. Uh, they instead of uh, so yeah, you go G minor, C minor, G minor, C minor, then G minor, and that's pretty much C minor except that you put your second finger on the A note, so it's like a C minor with an A on the bass, and that's what makes that A diminished fifth kind of sound. <laughs> Monster, Mr. Grinch, your heart's an empty hole. Yeah, I try not to get that. Because it sounds like weird. Um, but that's the whole tune right there, folks. You know, it's uh, the same thing over and over again. It's complex when you really look at it. Um, but once you got it, it's <laughs> once you got that groove, you don't have to do much screwing around, right? Uh, except for the little things where they do the, the D chord and then you got to kind of roll with the person singing. You got to be able to come back in at the right time instead of just staying in a fixed thing. You know, when you're singing this song and you do the, I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot pole. If someone is like too fixed and they can't work with it, then it's like, no, we count to four and then we got to go back to the G minor after that. So it'll cut them off, you know? I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot hole. Like, it'd be kind of uh, cutting off early or whatever. You just gotta roll with the lyricist because the song's all about the lyrics, obviously, right? And the person having fun singing it. That person who's had too much brandy on Christmas is, oh, the Grinch, I'm in it, I'm in it. <laughs> okay. So anyway, that's pretty much the whole thing. And now I'm going to actually show you guys a cover of me doing this song and Merry Christmas from How to Rock Campfire. <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs>
Mr. Grinch. You really are a heel. You're as cuddly as a cactus. You're as charming as an eel, Mr. Grinch. You're a bad banana with a greasy black peel. A monster, Mr. Grinch. Your heart's an empty hole. Your brain is full of spiders. You have garlic in your soul, Mr. Grinch. I wouldn't touch you with a 39 and a half foot pole. Mr. Grinch, you have termites in your smile. You have all the tender sweetness of a seasick crocodile, Mr. Grinch. Given a choice between the two of you, I'd pick the seasick crocodile. You're a rotter, Mr. Grinch. You're the king of sinful sots. Your heart's a dead tomato splotched with moldy purple spots, Mr. Grinch. You're a three-decker sauerkraut and toadstool sandwich with arsenic sauce. Mr. Grinch with a nauseous super nice. You're a crooked, dirty jockey, and you drive a crooked horse, Mr. Grinch. Your soul in an appalling dump heap, overflowing with the most disgraceful assortment of rubbish imaginable, mangled up and tangled up. You're a foul one, Mr. Grinch. You're a nasty, nasty skunk. Your heart is full of unwashed socks. Your soul is full of gunk, Mr. Grinch. The three words that best describe you are as follows, and I quote, stink, stank, stunk. <laughs> right on. The Grinch is like the best thing ever, man. I used to watch that as I was a kid, like a thousand times every Christmas. Just some things are just so nostalgic. But anyway, <clears throat> thanks everybody for watching my show. I'm Dustin Cormier for How to Rock a Campfire. Merry Christmas, and once again from the bottom of my heart, thanks so much for watching, you guys. Uh, I'm going to be doing these Christmas things pretty much till the end of December, and I hope you guys enjoy watching them just as much as I enjoy playing them. Peace and love, y'all.